Neighbor Nation TV, and this is all about Family Advocacy Week. As we kick off the 2020-2021 school year remotely, we knew that it was imperative that we communicated with students and parents, distributed resources, and provided detailed information on what to expect during our first quarter of remote learning. That is why we have Family Advocacy Week from August 31st until Friday, September 4th. As you can see, we have provided you with a brief overview of what is happening all week. When you come to the building for resource deployment, there are content resource returns and pickups. If you have any resources provided by the school from last spring, please bring them with you to resource deployment day. During Resource Deployment Day, students will receive a copy of their class schedules as well as what resources they need to pick up for specific classes. Please note that all, not all classes have materials for pickup. Students will collect all resources necessary for remote learning. And once again, every class that your student has may not have resources to pick up. During Resource Deployment, we will also have student kits. All students will receive them and most of them include notebooks, writing utensils, folders, and other things that will ensure that our students have everything they need in order to be successful during remote learning. On Monday, August 31st, and Thursday, September 3rd, during resource deployment, ninth grade students will exchange their current Chromebooks and chargers for a new MacBook. If you are in eighth grade, and if you are a student that has already returned their Chromebook to their home middle school, you will be able to receive your new Chromebook and it will be available on Thursday and Friday during resource deployment. If your student's device needs repair or no longer works, please contact Mr. Timothy Moore to schedule an appointment via telephone or email. His phone number is 913-627-7209 or you can reach him at his email at timothy.moore at kckps.org. If your child is either in band, orchestra, or choir, they must bring their instruments, uniforms, and sheet music with them to resource deployment. During this time, teachers will check their instruments as well as collect uniforms and sheet music. If you have questions about instrument checks, please contact our orchestra teacher, Mrs. Michelle Sweeten, our new band director, Dr. Daniel Kirk, or our choral director, Mrs. Becky Thomas. For a visual presentation of what resource deployment will look like, please watch the next video that is suggested in the thumbnail. It is entitled, Resource Deployment. During Family Advocacy Week, teachers will be contacting all Family Advocacy students and parents to set up a meeting time for conferences occurring August 31st through September 4th. During these meetings, teachers will discuss the following. Number one, communication how you are able to reach them and contact them. They will also share their teacher office hours. They will briefly talk about our new learning management platform, Canvas. They will discuss the daily school schedule, which is our normal building schedule. And finally, they will also discuss the attendance expectations. If you have any questions, our teachers will also be able to answer them. If there are any questions that they're unable to answer, they will also send those to our administrative team so that we'll be able to answer them during our virtual town halls. If you have any more questions about our family advocacy meetings, please contact your student's advocate. Virtual town halls will be held online where we will explain in depth the remote learning plan, attendance and grading expectations, introduce departments, as well as leadership teams. During our virtual town halls, you will also have an opportunity to ask questions live within our chat box, but then we'll also have a link to a parking lot where you're able to have your questions answered. If you join us on Wednesday or Thursday for the premieres, you will still be able to ask questions. Our virtual town hall committee will compile them and create a frequently asked questions document that will be sent out electronically to our families. Here you can see our schedule for our virtual town hall meetings. On Tuesday, September 1st, it will be via webinar. But then on Wednesday, September 2nd, and Thursday, September 3rd, you will be able to access our premieres via YouTube and Facebook. To access our premieres, you can find us on YouTube at Saber Nation TV or via Facebook 
at Sabre Nation. Thank you so much for joining us and we look forward to seeing you during Family Advocacy Week.